Hello IT pros, welcome back to my IT workshop. In this video I'm going to show you how to upgrade the BIOS version of this ASUS motherboard. And this uh, I'm going to do it directly from the, from the motherboard, so I'm not going to uh, access Windows in any way or use an external device. So the version, well the model for this motherboard is an ASUS H110M family and I'm using a Intel i5 processor. So in order to, to proceed with the, with the upgrade, I'm going to go to advanced mode, which is in the bottom right. Then I'm going to go to tool. I click on it and then Asus Easy Flash and Utility. So I have two options, do we upgrade it through the store, uh, storage device or via internet. So um, as mentioned before, I'm going to do it using internet. I have it connected to, to the network using a, a ethernet cable. And it's given me the option to choose between DHCP uh, and a static IP address and the one in the middle. So I'm going to choose the, the first one because that's the configuration I have. So I click next and then it's going to tell me latest BIOS file is 3007 and then I'm just going to click OK. So I'm downloading the firmware. I have already checked it online and, and it's about 4 megabytes. It's really small. And as you can see, this firmware version came out this year, 2018, uh, in August. So I'm going to click OK and this process is really quick. So of course you don't have to shut down your computer or, or something like that. So now the process is in place. As you can see, it's going very slowly, but then it's going to speed up. So what I'm going to do now is um, I'm going to stop the video and we're going to come back when it's done, like right now. This is the process that this is the process that actually takes like two minutes, two and a half. And I'm going to do the same. I'm going to stop the video and I'm going to come back when, when it is almost done. Well, here we are a few seconds ago, a few seconds after. So we are about to finish. The process is almost finished. Update successfully. System will be reset. You press OK and then the system is rebooting. So now it takes a few seconds, longer than any um, normal restart would take. I'm waiting for, for, the, for the logo to appear, for the ASUS logo. So there it is. Now American Mega Threads, and it's asking me to press F1 to run the setup. So I press F1 and I'm back to the, to the BIOS console. Well, to the BIOS menu. Now, if you see, we make a close up to the BIOS version, it says 3807. So we have an upgrade from what we had, which was 34. So now, what we are going to do is enable the. Um, the whole purpose of doing this upgrade was to ena enable the virtualization feature, which I couldn't which I didn't have, which I tried to, to activate or install in Windows, but it's not working because I didn't have the right um, firmware for the BIOS. So I'm going to go again to advanced mode. You can see here, I'm going to click on it. And then I'm going to go to advanced in the top of the screen. Now um, I'm going to I have I have different uh, I have information about the CPU and all that, but I'm going to do something here. So for you to know what I did is I went to advance, and then I'm going to look for CPU configuration. So in this case, it's the second option. I'm going to click on it, and I'm going to look something related with the virtualization. So let's look for it. Virtualizations, not here, oh, there it is. Intel virtualization technology. As you can see, it is disabled. I'm going to enable it. Enable, and I'm just going to save it. 
So I go down. And it says there, I'm going to go back to easy mode. I click on it and just save and exit or F10. So I click save and exit and it says Intel virtualization technology is now enabled. Okay. And that's pretty much it. That's all you need to do now. The system is going to reboot and we are going to log into Windows and we are going to install it, uh, that feature. Well, guys, that was for the short video. Thank you for watching. Um, I'll see you in the next one.